What's up? It's Mike Gobby with 93.3 KDKB. I'm here with my good friend David Elveson to talk about beams. What is this thing? <laughs> <laughs> it's daunting looking, isn't it? it? It's pretty cool. You got to tell me all about it. I've known about it before through friends and stuff, but right. I never really had a chance to uh, experience it. So, Well, there's kind of two parts to it. First of all, there's the, the player, the beams player, and this here is actually the uh, David Ellison limited edition signature series. Mm -hmm. So I've actually been working with beams for a couple years, um, and, and th there's lasers that go across it, so as you wipe your hand across it, it's actually hooked into a computer where the software is that actually triggers it. So essentially, this thing is like basically a trigger. So as you... <laughs> Right, as you okay. pass your hand through there, you can shred solos and... And so, uh, there it is, it stops. So that's basically what it is. In the setup, you can trigger drums, you can trigger a whole myriad of different instruments. Um, it has 37 interactive songs, and it's seven that I actually wrote myself to put on the, uh, the David Ellison uh, Beams Metal Factory uh, DVD. So that comes bundled with the signature player. What got you interested in Beams in the first place? Well, it's funny, Beams has, uh, it's actually been around for a little while, and um, I saw like a kind of a new rebirth of it, and especially when they reached out to me to create some content for it, some stuff that, that how I would play, I thought, you know, this is kind of cool because a lot of um, my fans, and metal fans, and rock and roll fans, you know, they, they, they love music, obviously, and some of them get a hankering to play, but you know, to pick up a bass or a guitar or drums, it's a commitment. I mean, you got to really put in the time, usually years and years of time, to learn how to play to get really good. And the thing that I thought was kind of cool with the Beams is that if I created some music or you use the Beams tracks that are in there, you can essentially step up to it and kind of the framework of the music is done. And if all you have to do is wave your hand over a laser beam, you can actually create or at least play some music without having to put in all the years to become a master of your instrument. Put a little fog in here, and you could have like a really Full cool on. thing going yeah, on. Right. So I just Look at that. Yeah, see, I'm a musician. You're a rock god, my friend. <laughs> so uh, yeah, it's really, and it's that simple. And 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 when you have the backing tracks going behind it, um, I think it's something that uh, it just becomes it becomes simple, you know. So for both musicians and non-musicians alike, I think the beams is a uh, something you know people of all ages, you know, kids that, that uh, of course they like to wave their hands and when things do things, it's kind of a, a the payoff, you know. So and this one is now, um, uh, like I say, the limited edition that we're doing um, coming up here on the holidays. So any information on it, just go to thebeams.com.